Welcome back to Post Plus. This place is some more for us for which we are uh, going for everything that's coming up in my house. We have to become member of the Holy Roman Empire and fully centralized said empire. We are finally a monarchy and therefore eligible to be um, elected emperor. We have not been elected emperor yet, and uh, we are actually currently, well, I say we're eligible. Kinda are. We also kinda aren't. Because our heir is like, well, we died very quickly after taking control of the empire or taking control of, after seizing executive power, aka becoming a monarchy. And uh, therefore our heir is super young. Because of course you can't get a child while you're a syndic. I'm sure that's how that works. Um... I mean, don't put too much thinking into that logic. Kind of royal marriages while you're a republic and you can't have children, I don't believe. You can. It's unlikely to get children without marriages. And then the end led to us not having an heir. Which is okay. I'm taking a fight in Salzburg here, which turns out to be okay, but I didn't put too much thought into it. Should have. Should definitely have done that. And I think I'm okay sieging here with oversized stacks, um, just so we don't get any surprises. Got to be a bit careful of the mine scenes here. They can't take back airport very quickly. They're probably fine. But I don't have much of an army up there, and that is uh, you know, a bit scary. These guys could finish their siege off. You know what, you can attach to me up here, my subjects kind of need you there. Maybe not here. Um, also, my subjects. Most of my subjects are not in the war, but Varia is. Be attachy, not CG, please. I'm going to try to get them up here to help me defend against mines and then attack them there. There's Bern, excellent. Let's really quickly take control of um, Vard and Freiburg. And then that should be good. Trade conflict, was to claim on Burgundy. I want the siege of Fulda. Merge, still be attached to. Bavarian general is pretty horrific. Um, but so is the Mycene one. I think they'll say fine, but they'll take still. Yeah, they're fine. We don't have the morale bonus we had from being a Republic before. And I miss it. Can't catch you guys here. Anybody else at war with me? No. So we march on Vienna then. Kind of fine to see Vienna, see Vienna like that. In a bit of a odd position. I mean, it's in the same position as always. It's just that they kind of lost everything around it. But Wartenburg inside to me, that's just not not nice. And then the Salzburg you get rid of these rebels? Gee. Peace from Mainz already. Um, I mean I have all their stuff. If troops left here? What would we want from them? I don't think we take Niederhessen. Double aggressive expansion is just too much. Um you don't need to fossil religion because that's our thing. I would like to say vote for me, but that's not the button I can press. So I guess we just do this. Oh, we actually don't have tons of prestige anymore. Um, maybe they don't make them steer trade. Maybe just go transfer trade power and grab a bunch of prestige from them instead. Seems better. Maybe for themselves? Maybe for themselves. Hot out here. No, we need a core hiding war. And I'm not quite sure where to get it right now. I mean, surely there's not somebody around, right? But, uh... Why can I not walk back? Head up. Hmm. Weird. Um, yeah, keep grabbing those ideas. Um, 
but no claims on burgundy anymore. We can't just use them as an excuse. Mines just got a truce to us. Uh, we got caught in Würzburg. I might have been able to make a claim there, but I didn't. As has happened a lot this campaign, it feels. Um, let's make claims on Oberpfalz. And maybe use guys. Are you filthy heretic by any chance? No. I mean, there's still this war, but I don't like the Great Britain part. I don't want to do that. You have claims on Saxony, which I could always do, I guess. I'd like to find a nice heretic to punish. I mean, Burgundy is one. Oh, but Cleansing of Heresy is not a CD we have. What's in Milan? Oh, that's just because we have no Carl's Belly. Let's make a claim on Burgundy again. Just so we have that option. There goes Edgetal. Um, can I? Could I force convert you? Uh, I could. You need. Um, as much as, as much war score as it would take to fully annex the target, and we have that. I mean, we don't have that, but uh, they are below 100%, so we can get that. I should say. Um, oh, apparently this is a cap. Papal influence cap at 200. I didn't know. Never been this high. Uh, we don't really have tons of options. We could go for a tax, but if I have more money, we could go for... My curriculum doesn't do anything. Legitimacy, prestige, that's already rather than stab. Theoretically, although again, I don't like going to three because I miss out on the positive stab events. Could just buy some invested. Why not? Let's invest some into becoming paper controller. It's not as if I really want to be. I mean, I don't know what I gained from it. I'm not interested in excommunicating people or calling for crusades. But can we at least like assign cardinals or something along those lines? I still don't quite know how that system works. Nuremberg. Come on, give me those sieges. The siege of Siemberi, which was this one, I believe. Can I walk to Saluzzo? I cannot. I'm going to block by a hostile fort. Oh, so I have to walk to Cuneo instead. Okay, fine. Let's walk to Andrew there. Now, why can Salzburg walk through the through Saxony, but I cannot? They're not at war. They grant conditional military access to Salzburg. Which is my enemy. I should have conditional military access. Right? Why do you even have conditional? For the following reasons. So actually gives access to Salzburg and war ally mines. But mines is no longer in the war. That's why I don't get military access anymore, but why do they get to keep it? Are we ally in another war somehow? No. They're not. I think that's just broken. Bugged. I mean, I'm gonna go and ask them for military access as soon as I have a diplomat, but um, it's gonna take some time. Unless I wanna pause something of this. Yeah, let's pause the Mycian stuff for a moment. Ask them for access. Um, I didn't need access through mines. Or oh, I need to Saxony. So now we're going to be over cap and it takes a month before I can revoke it from mines. Okay, you gave up the siege. It's fine. Um, sorry, mines, I didn't mean to do any of this. I just got very confused, as I do. 
You should be leaving 3rd, 1st, 3rd of September, yeah. Should only be fighting these guys. Um, but still I want to cancel that Mind Simulator access if I ever can. 10th of September. Oh, we should definitely check on the thing. Um, I think I need to start annexing Münster and Stat. Whoops. May 36? There is. Frick. <laughs> yeah, I screwed that one up. Um, well, then I can might as well wait until the 10th of September to cancel my military access here. Then three more days. And now start annexing Münster. Which will not quite be in line. It's close. But... Um, yeah, I missed the correct timing there. Yeah, if I can those hills, it'll be fine. Find a nice hill to die on. Uh, you should be trying to be alive. Didn't I beat the Seleucid army? Come on, give me that siege. There's Cuneo. That's not that siege, but it's a nice siege anyway. I can probably already piece out Seleucid if I <laughs> have any diplomats at all. Um, yeah, I really would like another diplomat, I must say. Time to become an elector. But... The filthy... Filthy emperor didn't want me to be an elector. Uh, Zweibrücken and Heidelberg. Um, Malhaus... Go back to... Protect trade... And then uh, force, Defend forcing, and yeah, we're not gonna get our peace before we drop below fifty power protection. Here, unfortunately, wait, am I not embargoing my rivals? Oh, should definitely be embargoing my rivals. The lack of diplomats are really starting to become annoying. Hmm. Can't say we have a, we have a lack of um, mill points though, I guess. Buy legitimacy again just for the absolutism. Keep chasing these people around, I guess. Münster's not in the war, so they won't be hurt there. Just don't want these guys to take Bern back. Don't think they will and too quickly, but still. Yeah, Salzburg, that's good. You go down south. I would peace out Salzburg, but... Okay, we can only have one of these claims. We want Burgundy or do we want the Palatinate? Burgundy is further ahead and I'm gaining more. Uh, yes. Let's cancel the Palatinate for now. Just don't have the people to do it. Um, peace out Salzburg. Uh, oh, and do I need prestige? Yes, I do. And a rivalry to the Pope or somebody? Sure. The ducats. I only have one rival. Shame on you. All right. Here for themselves? Yes. We could have fed them to the Bavar Bavarians. To the yeah, those Bavarians. To the Bavarians to increase their annexation timer. But I don't think that would have... definitely wouldn't have sunk up properly. Or it's extremely unlikely that it would have led to a proper sunk up. And would have caused too much of expansion. Because they were not co So I guess this is fine. Uh, let's go and um, embargo on the Spanish and the Ottomans. 
can't believe I haven't done that yet. I can't believe I haven't done this. Um, there we go. Should embargo. It should give me a bit of a, a bit of a leeway there. It's still not enough to stay above um, 50 fully. It'd be nice if we could fulfill another age objective, but absolutism is still a bit away. Multiculti nation is still a bit away. Large army is getting kind of close. But I do think I've built all the useful metal camps there. No, there's two more. Build them. Uh, oh, could I have better churches? Oh, we don't have the tech. Oh, one of my subjects must have the tech. That's why it's available there. And this is still pretty bad. So these. You got black flag now. Oh, they must have been somewhere on Salzburg in military access. And when I revoked that, then, or when I took Salzburg out of the war, they got black flagged. At least something about military access that's going right. <laughs> now you guys, I'm just gonna send you here to threaten these people. And I guess take them out, because they're sitting on a fort in hills or something. Which seems like a bad idea. Minus two. Is it mountains even? Probably mountains. Yep. I mean, considering that, they took a lot of our morale away. But... Well, why is that even? We started with much better morale. Must have just rolled horribly. There's Oberkärnten. No, I guess we could just each Unterkärnten. <laughs> of course. And we can probably start... Yeah, there's almost nobody left in the war. Um, start making proper siege stacks instead of having these giant attrition stacks. You're just gonna need the 10 cannons. For you and most of you. Set an overcounting short. I think I'm gonna have you guys march on Wien. Vienna. <laughs> We're just gonna stay there. Are you like? Yeah, that's fine. I really like Torino. I don't need to go home. I mean, it's a good idea. They would die if they went home. But. Interesting behavior, nonetheless. Nonetheless. Now, I have a free diplomat. Now, when do I have to annex Cilia? I probably still have some time. Um, February 35. I believe Bavaria is done in something, something 36. February 36. So we have a year. May 34. And then, unfortunately, Münster is going to be behind a bit. But not a lot. It's kind of fine. Um, speaking of not having stupid siege stacks... Oh! That infantry was hurt a bit. <laughs> um, what do we need here? Ten artillery would be nice. But only six people in total. My subjects are delivering none artillery. I'm gonna just grab everybody else. Not attached to those. Get out. Be safe. And then here in Vienna. Four artillery stands. Because they don't have more. The rest out. We have artillery left on here. We do. Should probably then send six artillery and six people up here. Bit of a long walk. But we'll have to do. And you need how many more cannons? Like two? You have nine. Oh, but very actually providing cannons. Look at that. Um, so you only need the one cannon to be fully powered. And you guys can go home or even better go to, I mean, yes, go home, but be ready to attack the Burgundians. 
when I ask you to. Not that we have our claims yet, but we're working on it. Close to camping on mill again. Still a bit away from the tech. Oh, we're losing on the star as prestige because we have. No, it's not true. Losing legitimacy because we have the uh, regency. I don't know why the prestige is dropping. It feels like it's dropping faster than usual. But what do I know? Um, spend some mill. Yeah, I guess it's just development. In. Like, Yura. Uh, da, da, da. Encourage. Clickety clickety. Done. Come on, Cetus. Zwei Brücken. We already have the Edict on in Heidelberg, so that can be next. Saluso wants peace. Oh, we should probably talk to them. The only reason I didn't talk to them earlier was that I didn't have a diplomat. Which I now do. Don't think I need their land. Do I need land of theirs? Uh, I might need. I do need Ginevra, actually. That's slightly annoying. Oh, I can't take it. Oh, I have the border and bodies here. Now it's going to be non co and It's going to hurt quite a bit on the AE. But I need this, and then I don't have to come back for these guys. It's a lot of AE though. Hmm. 17 development. We should probably come back for that later. Maybe I just um, do a short PC with them instead. I mean, just white piece them? Or break the Austrian alliance? Do I care about the Austrian alliance? Not very much, no. Might just white piece them. Short piece here and then come back. Yeah. Let's do that. Guarantee oh, you're guaranteeing Burgundy. That's the reason to keep you in the war for now. Okay. Because I don't want to immediately go back to war with them. We could now take things for higher war score cost and then go to war with Burgundy and sort of reset the peace timer. However, the only things I would take are timed contracts anyway, like transfer trade power. And those would end as soon as we go to war. So that's no point. Yeah. Well, that's a lot of peasants. Do I kill these Austrian peasants? I guess I do. What a waste. They annoy me. It's not like that costs me too much. Wait, something was occupied by Austria? Oh. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. Whatever. Probably gonna cost me a bit of... Prosperity or something. Yeah. So that's all of Saluzo. I, mean, I can probably just peace out. I don't need to siege Vienna, probably. Everybody being in the war. Uh, let's have a quick look. I want all the things I have claims on. And hopefully not have too much aggressive expansion for it. I can't take Freiburg. Um, should I have claims on more things? Yeah, Bern, Freiburg, and Wart. It should be Zurich as well. Oh yeah, Borgol. That annoys a few people. We may have to come back. <laughs> um, yeah, we'll have to come back. Intel I don't need for the thing, for the mission.
I don't think this coalition would fire as long as I have France as an ally, but I might not have France as an ally for much longer. So, I don't think this is clever. I think we're gonna have to come back. Any reason to take anything specifically? Oh, we're taking Ginevra, that's not the plan. That should help. That's much better. That's not a coalition that's gonna fire against me. And a lot of those people are gonna be out of the coalition in a jiffy. So that's fine. Yeah, we can't be out just yet though. Uh, due to the whole having nobody else to attack thing. Is that true? Do I just have a war I can do? I can't do Salzburg. I could do Sax Saxony. But that's a pretty big war for what I'm not really interested in doing at all. Unless Saxe Lauenburg, Oldenburg and or oh, Saxony are filthy heretics. Saxony is, but they're probably too big to convert. Hundred percent, that might work. We could even have some more admin efficiency if we need to. Okay. It's you and then it's Saxe Lauenburg, which is probably also filthy. They, they sound very filthy. No, they're not. And, um... Oldenburg. Of course, our best friends in Mainz. Oldenburg. Yeah, I think that's my... my coring war. Never mind Burgundy. I found somebody else. <laughs> to bully. Let's get you up there. But that means I can peace out Saluzo, because... the... Um, guaranteeing of Burgundy won't matter for that. Sure. How much do I care about Saluzo? Maybe I break the guarantee? Yeah, I think I'm gonna break the guarantee of... Can I not? Um... I guess I can't? Okay, I'm not gonna do it. Fine. Super peace. You get a nice white piece, Saluzo. Be happy. And then, once we're in position up there, which we kinda are, try to catch these Austrians and then declare war on the. Not gonna catch them. We should go and declare war. Sachs Lomburg, Mainz, Oldenburg. Uh, do we get a white black flag in Mainz? I don't know. We'll see. Take Braunschweig. France wouldn't even come in. I mean, multiple wars, I guess. Um, yes. I don't actually mean to take Braunschweig. Oh, yeah, I do get black flagged. It's fine. Just gonna have to do this one. <laughs> I guess we go straight back into mines then. And now once our diplomat is back, we can piece out the Austrians. Should I marry France? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. Oh. Once again, we have population issues. Yeah, it is what it is. Let's piece out Austria for this, I believe. It's also December, that's very nice, very useful, because a lot of these guys are going to take out at the end of, end of the month. There's a chance we should wait until the end of the month, but I don't think this this coalition is even going to try to fire. So that's going to be okay. Give me that stuff. Um, do we want a longer peace to the Austrians? Probably. Yes, we have to come back. No, we don't have to come back, right? We're taking all the coins. Not taking Intel, but that's not the one that's relevant. Let's quickly check the mission tree. I think we actually don't have to come back. Austria shall fall. Wait, that's not the one. Wasn't there one that required me to have all of Switzerland's stuff? Oh yes, this one I'm complete. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the one. 
The one afterwards we're gonna have to eat uh, more Austria and even uh, Milan. But for now, yeah, we're taking all the relevant provinces. Oh, we have to own Memmingen? Huh. That's not great. Alright, but that means we can do some, like, at least take their war reps and their trade power. And they don't want it. What? Well, give you a moment then. I still definitely want that. I feel like I've seen this stuff down before. Bit of a deja vu. Siege of Unterkern, and we feel like peace now. Yes, you do. We ducats too? Yes. Alright. Seed me a bunch of stuff. It is the end of December. Excellent. And we have another war to fight on Corn. We don't have tons of admin, but probably, yeah. Easily enough for this. Bit over governing capacity now. Um, that's something we need to fix. Which admin would help us do? Because the finishing of our idea group would finish that. Should I sit on the over extension for a moment so I can finish the the thing? We also have less core creation cost penalty from that. Maybe I do actually do that. Let's uncore these. It's a lot of overextension. But. It's probably worth it? Tough to say. Um, 12 admin a month. That's what we're making. And we're gonna need. It's fine. I'm gonna wait for the tech. Uh, it gives us the over extension penalty for a bit, but that is actually not a huge problem for us, I don't think. So we don't really care about unrest, which is the main penalty. Sure, have that military access, Austria. Uh, can I get admin? No. I'm definitely not losing his stability. 34 pretenders? Okay. Um, or autonomy in zwei Brücken, gain loyalty on the nobles, lose prestige. Honestly, this is fine. I can get the prestige back easily. Autonomy, I can just buy down and turn that into um, absolutism. Might even be good for me. Yeah. Took down Airfoot. I don't believe that that's enough to... Do you want that battle in woods? Probably not. I have more armies that can come north. Get up here. The fear of, well, the lord into them, I guess. Not the law. <laughs> it should be the law. It should be the emperor. I just don't understand. Um, quick check with the annexation. What is this? May 36. And silly would be February 36. Which is also what you have, right? And your August 36. Okay. So very soon. So I need to click that silly button. Click that silly button. There goes Fulda. This should mean mines runs out, very much so. Mines is not to be declared upon, so we might as well just do the stuffs. Don't care about your steering of trade. Let's give me that and give me my prestige back. And some ducats. Get out of here, mines. That should also greatly reduce enemy troops, and that's a nice thing to do. Uh, I do have to put, oh, to end this episode, however, I kind of would like to start the... Uh, 
um, start the annexation of my subject silly before I end the episode because I will forget to do it at the start of the next episode and that would be very sad. Uh, quickly check. Is there anything, oops, anything cool we got here? This one diplomat is actually useful right now. I wonder if we should take that. The rest kind of not. I can't stop you yet. I could stop this yet, but I like having the diplomat rep right now, so we're not going to drop that. Okay. Um, let's make our claim on Burgundy. Before we forget. Come home. Um, an X March. Yeah, okay. Two more months. Can do this. <laughs> Luckily, we have some some sort of some leeway with the timing this time. Let's go again. Where the heck are you going? Erfurt, Niederhessen, Wismar, Leipzig, Göttingen, Braunschweig. What? Did you say you're going to Goslar? It does. Um. Oh, this one. It's the one you. It looks like you're already in Goslar, but you're not. Alright, try to walk like this maybe and catch them in the airport if we can. No, cannot. It's April. I think next month is the time. Uh, don't attach to me, please. It's a bit attrition what you're doing. May, it is May. Okay. Uh, silly. Annex. Done in April. Wait. Should this be in May? April. Hmm. Anyway, annex. Do it. And then put that cut in here. Thank you guys for watching. If you like what you're seeing, as always, please hit that like button, subscribe if you're not subscribed yet, and anything you want to say to me, do it down there in that comment section. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.